communicate employee expectations. You expect your employees to do their best to be as productive as they can be, to be hard working, to be punctual at work, and to communicate better with the company. The problem is, your employees seem to do the opposite. They are not as productive as you want them to be, they are not that hard working, they are always late to work, and they have poor participation in company activities. You're wondering what the problem is. Have you ever wondered if they know what your expectations are? Expecting something and failing to achieve that expectation results in disappointment. At this point, you are already disappointed with your employees. Is it their fault or are you ineffective in communicating your expectations for your employees? You see, your employees will never match your expectations or even try to reach them if they don't even know what these expectations are. So even at the moment you are hiring new employees, you should be clear about these expectations. There's no better way to do that but to communicate employee expectations. Here are some helpful tips on how to communicate employee expectations. 1. Be clear about these expectations. What does your company expect from the employees? Maybe you are expecting some of them to work on closing a multi-million dollar deal and if they do, they'll have bonuses. You should be clear on what these expectations are. There are many avenues on how to do this effectively like an open forum. If you have only a manageable number of employees for a forum, then why not set up one and take time for them to listen to you? This way, they will all know what the company expects from them and they can suggest, comment, or recommend things for the betterment of all. Representative Meeting If your employees have leaders or supervisors, then you should meet with them and orient them about your expectation from each group. Letter Make a written communication that lists all the company expectation from the employees. This is a good guide because the employees can read the expectations over and over again. To listen to their expectations, too. This way the employees would know what you expect from them. What about their expectations from the company? Effective communication is a two-way process you talk to them and they listen and they talk to you and you listen. Three expectations should be in line with the employees and the company's values and beliefs. You don't want to do anything against your value, so do your employees. Learn more about your employees' values so you can frame your expectations from them in line with these values and beliefs. By following these tips, you are on your way to better communication for employee expectations. 
listen to your employees, too, and consider what they expect from the company. By doing so, you will promote harmony and better company employee relationship. The end result will be beneficial both to you and your employees. You, as an employer, will get competitive employees and your employees will get a company worthy to be working with.